Hi, I'm Dr. Norm McVeigh, or Norm, and I am the author of the book here, Coherent Coaching. This is using energy tapping to release energetic blockages on various subjects. Today we'll be working with goal attainment. And this, my company is called iBliss, and there are energy fields encoded in this uh, field, in this uh, audio and video here to help you release energetic blockages. The field is white light. Now, I'll let you know I've been coaching people for 35 years and training coaches. I've trained a few thousand of them. And I'd like you to experience this here. So turn the volume up, up uh, you know, so it's, you really can hear it. And it'll put through the energy field in the audio and the video tracks. And my goal here is with my book is to improve your coaching ability by 100 times and to go 100 times faster in the releasing of energetic blockages. Now, this is advanced uh, energy psychology. And uh, so you, you'll get to appreciate it as you get a chance to work with it. And I have a training program about this also on YouTube as well. And if you take and place your left hand on the speaker and tap like this, or tap with both hands with the energy field up, with the uh, audio up, uh, that will work very nicely. And when you do the left hand's input, when you put your left hand on there, it comes out through your right hand when you're tapping, the white light comes out through your fingers, so it speeds the process up considerably. Now I'd like to make an agreement with you guys, and it's if you choose to perform this process, I ask you to take 100% responsibility for it. I ask you to be 100% responsible and not hold me liable or my staff or employees or anything like that. That you be 100% responsible for the results, the outcome, whatever that is. And that's the way that it works best. If you, if you do it thinking, oh, you know, I don't know, this guy's kind of responsible, this doesn't work. Just in that case, I would not do this program. You know, if you can't make that agreement, don't do it. If you're listening to me now, I, I agree that you've made that agreement. And if you continue, uh, continue on that 100% agreement uh, relationship we described. Now there's a number of ways you can do this program. Uh, I'm going to work generally on goals in general, but if you have a specific goal you're working on, we can work on that goal specifically too by you naming that during the process. And again, on my book here, I go into this in much more detail. Okay, so goal attainment. The purpose is to release the mechanical intentions of must-have and opposing can't-have contradictions or contradictory intentions from your goals so they're easily accomplished without effort, force, or pretense. All right, I'm going to do the tapping here just as an energy tapping, but you can do it other ways as well too, but I'll demonstrate this just in case you don't know this style. You can help, you can learn this and imprint this. Okay, so I love and accept myself even though I sabotage my own goal attainment. And repeat that after me, please. I'll give you space to do so. So I'll say it again. I love and accept myself even though I have sabotaged my goal attainment. All right, I love and accept myself even though I stand in the way of my own goals sometimes. Okay, I can hear you repeating that. That's great. All right, so on we go. And you can follow me in any sequence you want of tapping or of tap along with me in the same points I tap. Okay, and I just move around randomly according to what I feel. Okay. I can't be what I want to be. I can't do what I want to do. I can't have what I want to have. Okay, and take a deep breath. Okay, so you can choose a goal that's meaningful to you at this point, or we can just take this on, on general terms here, but this can be about getting a better job or a new skill or making more money or starting a business, you know, whatever you like. Okay, so right after you make your choice, what happens? Okay, what happens is this. I'm not sure if this is the right one for me, this goal that I've chosen. I'm not sure if this is the right one for me. I wonder if this is the wrong one. I think I've worked on this goal before and it hasn't turned out. I choose this as a major goal in my life. No, this is not a major goal in my life. I unchoose this as a major goal in my life. And I'm tapping here. I probably can't uh, show you this as well as I could, but I'm tapping right below the nipples here on the, on the chest. Probably won't do those right for this one here, so you can't see them as well. 
So I didn't choose that as a major goal in my life. Okay, I feel the effort in wanting that goal. And I feel life pushing back at me, against me, in having that goal turn out. I, I feel the opposing forces in choosing this goal. I feel the contradiction of other people and myself in choosing this goal. Someone or somebody out there or something is keeping me from having this goal. It must be coming from outside of me. Couldn't be me. No, it couldn't be me. There must be somebody preventing me from having this goal. I wonder who it could be. Maybe no one's preventing me from choosing this goal and succeeding. Maybe it's just me. Only I can prevent myself from having this goal turn out. Okay, I'd like you to make this goal a little more real. Make it a little more real and take a little more responsibility for it. Okay? This goal is my goal. And I really want it to turn out and I'm committed. Okay? This goal is my goal. I'm committed to it and I really want it to turn out. Re feel it. Okay? I don't care if this goal turns out or not. I'm not interested in it. I don't care if this goal turns out. I don't care. I don't care if this goal turns out. It's not my goal. I don't think I can make this goal take place. It's too overwhelming. Nope. Too upsetting. Can't do it. It's not possible. I'm being prevented. Way too overwhelming. Can't do it. I don't need to do it. I don't need to have this goal. Nah. Not, not interested. Okay, let's make it more real now. Oh, I think I'd like this goal to turn out, maybe. That's somewhat important to me. Yeah, I'd like to have it turn out if it's no big deal. I'm partially committed to it. Maybe it will. I'll do some things to have it turn out and some things not. Yeah, I hope it turns out. It'd be really cool. I'm really willing to be committed to this. It'd be great if this turns out. I I've been suppressing how great I'd feel if this turned out. Wow, this would be tremendous. I'd really like this to turn out. It's, it's hard for me to admit how much I want this. It's hard for me to admit how much greater my life would be if this turned out. It's really difficult to say how important this is. I, I just don't want to fail, so I just can't, I, I pretend like I'm not interested. I can tell the truth about this goal. And I release all suggestions of others or force this goal may be carrying in my life or any content regarding it. I'm willing to let go of anything else, anything that's in its way. It'd be nice just to feel like what it'd be like to be clear on this goal. I release all times I said I'd quit. And I release all sense of failure. No, no, I can't go on with this goal. It's really too much. It's just really too much. I'm looking at it now and it's just too overwhelming. Uh, I can't do it. No. No. No, it's just too overwhelming. I, I can't do it. I'll, I'll let it go. But when I feel like I let it go, it makes me feel bad. It makes me feel like I've given up. Well, I wonder if I could let, I wonder if I could just choose to have it or not have it. I wonder if I could choose to be it or not be it. 
do it or not do it, have it or not have it. It's a big, big responsibility. Maybe I'll pursue it and I'll quit if I see fit. Because just because I started doesn't mean I have to finish it. I can try it on for size. I can take some baby steps. And I can see how it turns out. And if it feels like something that's worthwhile, I'll go at it. But what's really most important to me is finding out the truth about this goal. Am I really interested in it, or is it just something that came from someone else? Is it a solution to a problem, or something I really want to do? Am I free about this goal, or am I trapped with it? And I clear all false intentions off this goal. I clear all effort, all force, all pretense. Hey, it's just me here. I clear any advice other people have given me about it. Maybe it wasn't so supportive. I clear all the suppression of others off this goal. I clear all the invalidation of others off this goal. And I release all the jealousy of others off this goal. I clear all the feelings of competition about this goal. I'm free to attain this goal, and I'm free to move towards it. I'm also free to move away from it. My choice, and it's my choice all the way. No one has to tell me how to do it. I'll let my higher self and my higher consciousness come through. I'll just get out of the way and see where it is about it. And see what's trying to happen here. Wow, that's a great question. What's trying to happen here? What's trying to move through me to cause this goal to manifest or not manifest, or to cause me to call it complete and move on? What's the ultimate truth about this goal? What's really so about this goal? What's really me about this goal? I'm free to, free not to. About this goal, I can be anything, do anything, or have anything. All I want to do is visualize it first, and then let it move through me. But I'm open to the highest good about this goal. I can make it as real as I want, make it as unreal as I want. I can choose to be in control of this goal, or I can visualize that the goal is in control of me. Free to, free not to. I'm open to the goal, and I'm open to finding out my higher wisdom. Whatever it is, I want to tell the truth about this. I want to be without force, without effort, and without pretense. I see white light healing myself regarding this goal. I'm bringing this goal into the present moment. And I'm sourcing this goal from the present moment, from the now. And I'm blessing it with all the energy of the nowness, and all the energy of the present moment, and all the energy of truth. My most important goal in life is to tell the truth. And telling the truth about this goal is the highest service I can do this goal and myself and everybody connected. And if this goal is created, and if I manifest this goal, it's through the magic of being myself. And that's the magic of telling the truth. I'm in service to this goal, and this goal is in service to me. And I ask myself, what's trying to come through? And I'm listening deeply. And I'm open to higher intelligence. And I'm open to my emotional intelligence to tell me the truth. And I know the truth's there. And I am a vessel for that truth, and I'm willing to hear it. Thanks for doing that process. You can review it as many times as you want. 
And the higher you turn up the volume, the more you turn up the energetic field of the white light. I have other videos out there and other tapping sessions, so I look forward to seeing you again. Blessings. Truth be with you.